I go and play. I meet new friends. And we all say, hello, hello. What's your name? Nice to meet you. Do you want to play? Hello, hello. What's your name? Nice to meet you. Do you want to play? Okay, I think you have it now. Let's try it again, but now we're going to sing it. So remember, if you don't know the words, that's okay. You can just repeat after me or after this cute little bird. All right, let's try it now with some music. Ooh, this is a good one. Okay, remember, repeat. Every day. Every day. I go to school. I go to school. I meet my friends. I meet my friends. And we all say. And we all say. Good. How are you? How are you? I'm good. I'm great. How about you? Good. One more time. Hello, hello. How are you? I'm good. I'm great. How about you? Okay. Nice job. I heard you singing on that. You sounded really good. Okay, are you ready for the next part? Remember, I go to school. I play. Every day. I go and play. I meet new friends. And we all say, hello, hello. What's your name? Nice to meet you. Do you want to play? One more time. Hello, hello. What's your name? Nice to meet you. Do you want to play? Excellent. You did a good job. Wow. That was great. I heard you singing even with all those little chickies singing too. Was that fun? Even a little? I hope so. I love singing. That's a good way to learn how to say hello. Hello, how are you? I'm good. I'm great. How about you? Or when you meet someone new. Hi, how are you? Maybe you wave. Maybe you shake hands. Maybe you give a hug. Maybe you just yell, hello. Nice to meet you. Okay, so when I ask, how are you? Maybe you can say, I'm good, I'm great. Or maybe you feel something different. Let's see. How are you feeling today? Maybe you feel sad. I'm sad. Hmm. Maybe you feel uh, angry. What's another way to say angry? Mad. I'm mad. I'm angry. Uh. Or maybe uh, you feel scared. Uh, oh no. Or maybe you're like me today and you feel happy. Do you feel 
Sleepy? Or maybe you feel bored. Bored. Do you feel shy? What is shy? Shy. I feel shy when I meet someone new. Maybe I'm a little scared to say hello. I'm a little shy. Are you confused? Hmm? I'm confused. These are a lot of nice feelings. Do you feel any of these today? What about sad? What do you do when you're sad? Maybe you can cry or listen to a sad song or talk to a friend. What about uh, angry? I'm angry, I'm mad. What do you do when you are angry? Do you yell? Ah, I'm angry. Do you walk around and stomp your feet? I'm angry. Maybe you stay quiet. I don't know. What do you do? What do you do when you are scared? What's that sound? I'm scared. Maybe you hide. Maybe you talk to your mother or father or friend or brother or sister. I don't know. What do you do when you are happy? When I'm happy, I smile. Big smile. I laugh. Ha 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 ha. I love to be happy. Sleepy. Oh, I'm sleepy. I'm tired. When I'm sleepy, I go to bed. Oh. I take a nap. Maybe I drink some tea. What do you do when you're sleepy? Bored. Ooh. <sighs> I'm bored. There's nothing to do. It's raining. <sighs> what do you do when you're bored? When I'm bored, I sing la la la, la or I read, <sighs> or I play video games. What do you do when you're bored? Hmm. What's the next one? Shy. Do you remember shy? Shy. Hi. Hi. I'm Lauren. That's shy. Are you shy? Hmm, sometimes I'm shy, but right now, no, I'm happy. Okay, what's the last one? Confused. Hmm, I'm confused. I'm confused. 
When I'm confused, I ask for help. Teacher, teacher, I'm confused. Can you help me? What do you do when you're confused? Do you ask for help? Excellent. Okay. Nice job. I heard you saying all of those names. Sounded very good. Okay. How are you feeling right now? Are you ready to do a little reading with me? Please, oh please, oh please, oh please. I love to read. We should read together. Do you want to? Okay. Let's do it. Let's read something fun. I think I know just the perfect book. Hmm. Aha. Perfect. I don't want to eat bugs. Ooh, what a strange title. Do you know about this book? This is a really good book. I don't want to eat bugs. Ugh. Let's take a look. Lisbon was hungry. Hmm. Who's Lisbon? What do you think? Is this Lisbon? No, maybe this? No, I think Lisbon is this little girl right here. Lisbon was hungry. Her tummy was making all kinds of hungry noises. She needed to find something to eat. Let's look. <gasps> Growl. Ooh, her tummy is talking. When I'm hungry, my tummy talks too. What about you? Does your tummy make noises when you're very, very hungry? Okay, let's look at the next page. The kitchen smelled yummy. Mmm, yummy, like <gasps> delicious, like good food. Pizza and pasta and ice cream. Mmm. Dinner is almost finished, Mom said. Why don't you go outside to play? I'll call you when it's ready. Okay, Lisbon said. Okay, let's look at Lisbon's room. She has a very nice room. What color? Are the things in Lisbon's room? What color is her lamp? What color is the photo? What color is her dresser? Do you know? It's purple. Just like her shirt. What color is her green frog? Oh, I told you, it's green. We can see it again here in the kitchen. The bedroom. The kitchen. What do we do in the bedroom? Do we take a shower? No. Do we sleep? Yes. Do we play? Yes, of course. What about the kitchen? What do we do in the kitchen? Do we sleep? Uh, no, we don't sleep in the kitchen. We cook and we eat. 
Very good. Okay, let's see what happens next. Lisbon went outside. Delicious dinner smells came from all her neighbors' houses. Her tummy wanted to eat now. It's hard to wait, Lisbon said. Oh, look, what's all this? Lisbon can smell. She can smell all of the delicious food that her neighbors are cooking. Can you smell what your neighbors are cooking right now? Let's try. Mmm, I smell tacos. I smell apple pie. Mmm, delicious. It's hard to wait. I agree, Lisbon. When I'm really, really hungry, it's so hard to wait. You don't have to wait chirped a bird sitting on a tree branch. I have yummy food right here. <gasps> Lisbon peered up into the tree and the bird gave her a nice fat bug. <gasps> a bug? For dinner? Hmm, I don't know about this. Let's look at some of the words on this page. Chirp. Hmm, what is chirp? Chirp is the sound a bird makes. Chirp, chirp, chirp. Chirp, chirp, chirp. Very nice. The bird is sitting on the tree branch. Chirp, chirp, chirp. What about this word right here? Lisbon peered. What is she doing? She's looking. Peer is another word for look. She looked up into the tree. She peered up into the tree. Very nice. Oh, I have a question. What color is the bird? He's blue. Nice job. Okay, let's see what happens next. <gasps> the shiny black bug had many legs that wiggled. They tickled her hand. <gasps> Ooh. Wiggle, what is this one? Ooh, for this one, maybe I'll show you. Wiggle, what's wiggle? I can show you, wiggle is like, wiggle, wiggle, wiggle. <gasps> it's when you move your body Really, really fast. Wiggle, 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 wiggle. Maybe if you're itchy and you can't scratch, maybe you wiggle, 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 wiggle. So the little bug in her hand. Ooh. Let's see what happens next. They tickled her hand. Tickle, tickle, tickle. She stared at the bug. And the bug stared at her. The legs wiggled faster. Wiggle, 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 wiggle. Lisbon wrinkled her nose. She didn't want to eat that poor bug. She opened her fingers and the bug dropped to the ground and ran away. Let's look at some other words on this page. She stared at the bug and the bug stared at her. 
Well, let's look. <gasps> Stare is another word for look. Hmm. So, we have look, we have peer, and we have stare. But they all mean look. Nice job. Some good words here. Okay. What else? Lisbon wrinkled her nose. She wrinkled her nose. Hmm. Wrinkle. Wrinkle is like my shirt. It's wrinkled. Wrinkle my nose. Let's try. Can you wrinkle your nose? We wrinkle our nose when we see something not so good. Maybe something gross. A bug for dinner? Hmm, maybe it's good, but for Lisbon, she thinks, mm-mm. So she wrinkle her nose. Nice job. Let's go back. Okay. Stay hungry then, said the bird. I'll catch another bug for me. And she flew away. Lisbon's cat, Cupcake, rubbed against her leg. Bugs are for the birds, she said. I have something much better. Oh, what's this word? Rubbed. Let's take a look. Rub. When you have two things together. I'm rubbing my hands. I'm rubbing my face. So, in the picture, let's look. Cupcake rubbed her leg. Excellent. Okay, let's continue. Cupcake stalked up to the bush next to the tree and dived inside. Ha! Seconds later, the cat came out with a big mouse in her paw. She held it out to Lisbon. This is my dinner. But you can have the first yummy bite. <gasps> A mouse? Lisbon grabbed the mouse's tail and lifted it high into the air. The mouse stared at her with eyes as round as gumdrops. <gasps> he had a pointy nose and tiny whiskers. We can see the whiskers here. Whiskers. His paws, his paws are like his hands, but with animals, we don't say hands, we say paws. His paws waved frantically in the air. Go on, said Cupcake. I'm hungry too, you know. The mouse squeaked and wiggled. He was kind of cute. Lisbon's stomach growled with hunger, 
But the mouse didn't look like dinner. She put the mouse on the ground and he ran away. Oh my goodness. Let's look at some of these words here. Here, let me show you. Okay, so she grabbed the mouse and lifted it high in the air. And the mouse stared. Remember that word? Stared. With his paws in the air, waving frantically. He's a little mouse and a big human. <gasps> Scary for the mouse. But Lisbon did not want to eat the mouse. So she put him away. Well, thanks a lot, said Cupcake. You just lost my dinner. Don't mind her, said Rocky, the dog next door. A mouse tastes good, but it's barely a mouthful. What we need is a hedgehog. Come with me. Let's see. What is a hedgehog? Lisbon wondered. She followed Rocky to the empty field across the street. They ran up a hill and down the other side. They ran around some trees and peered under bushes. There was no hedgehog in sight. Rocky finally sat down panting. Ooh, what's panting? That's a good word. Panting is what our dogs do when they're maybe tired or hot. It looks like that. <laughs> That's panting. My dog pants when he's hot. He sticks out his tongue <laughs> Okay, who needs a hedgehog anyway, he said. I have food in my bowl at home. It's very tasty. Come with me, you'll love it. Okay, Lisbon scratched Rocky's neck until he was rested. Then they went to his house. Rocky! That's a nice name for a dog. Do you have a dog? Maybe you have a cat. Hmm, let's see what happens next. Near Rocky's doghouse, in the backyard, sat a bowl of round brown nuggets. Nuggets like little, little pieces of food. Rocky gave them a big sniff. <sniffs> Yum! You first. Go ahead. Take one. Hmm. We can see Lisbon is looking at the food. Do you think the food looks Good or bad? Hmm, I think Lisbon is wrinkling her nose. What is she thinking? Hmm, Lisbon picked up a piece of dog food. It felt hard. She sniffed it like Rocky had done. Ew, that smells yucky. She threw the piece of dog food. Ooh, boom. B 
before the nugget hit the ground, Rocky snatched it out of the air and gulped it down. Ooh, okay, we got some good words here. So, remember, what did Lisbon do? She had the dog food. What did she do? She <laughs> sniffed it. Ew. She threw it. What did Rocky do? He snatched it and gulped it down. He ate it because it's dog food and Rocky's a dog. He likes it. What do you mean? He said. It's great. And he began to eat the rest of his food. Lisbon left Rocky and started for home. On the sidewalk, she saw her friend, Jordan, eating an ice cream cone. Oh, yum. That looks so yummy, Lisbon said. Jordan took a big lick. It is. You should ask your mom for one. I will. With a smile, Lisbon hurried home. Ice cream sounded perfect for her hungry tummy. Mmm, excellent. She sees the ice cream. She's so hungry. I don't know if Lisbon can wait for dinner. Let's see what happens next. Mommy, mommy, she said, running into the kitchen. Can I have ice cream? I'm so hungry. Good idea, mom said. You can have some after dinner. It's all ready. So Lisbon ate chicken and rice and salad. See here she's eating. Now she's finished. Look, she ate everything. Then her mother gave her a big ice cream cone with chocolate on top. It looked so yummy. Mmm. Lisbon sat on her porch and ate her ice cream. I don't want to eat bugs, she said between licks, or a mouse, or a hedgehog, whatever that is, or dog food. I love chicken and rice and salad, and especially ice cream. Yum. Excellent. Oh, the ice cream looks so good. <gasps> All right, so let's go through. Let's see if we can find all of the ice creams. I see one, I see two, let's go back, mm, oh, ice cream, excellent, that sounds like a very nice day for Lisbon, she had her dinner and she had her ice cream, mmm, What's your favorite meal? Do you like rice? Do you like pasta? Maybe falafel? Hmm, how about 
pizza. Broccoli? There's so many, many good foods. What about dessert? Like ice cream and cake and cookies. Do you have dessert after dinner? Sometimes I do. And my favorite? Definitely ice cream. Mmm, I love it. Nice job reading with me. Do you remember some of the words that we learned? Well, we learned peer. What's peer? Remember, with the eyes. When you peer, you're looking small. Peer. Okay. Stare. What is stare? Ah, with your eyes. Stare is when you look and you look and look and look. I'm staring at you. What are you staring at? Ah, at me? Ooh, okay. What are some of the other words that we learned? <gasps> wiggle. Do you remember that one, wiggle? That's a fun one. Wiggle, wiggle, wiggle. Maybe you wiggle when you're dancing. Maybe you wiggle when you are itchy. Wiggle, wiggle, wiggle. Okay, excellent. What about whiskers? Whiskers. Ah, remember? I'm a mouse. I have whiskers, little hairs. Cats have whiskers. Dogs have whiskers. And mice have whiskers. Okay, what else? What other words? So many. Oh, squeak. Squeak. Can you say that? Squeak. A squeak is a sound. A very small sound. Squeak. 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 Mice, when they talk, they squeak. Can I hear your squeak? Very cute. Excellent, nice job. Okay. What else? Oh, here's another good one. Remember when Lisbon grabbed the mouse? What is grab? Grab. I am grabbing the letter. When you take really, really fast. Grabbing is not always nice when you're playing with a friend. You shouldn't grab. You should ask, can I see your letter? Of course. Thank you. No grabbing. Okay. I think we have a few more words that we learned. Do you remember? I know one. Rub. Rub. Mm, remember, what is rub? Rub. Rub. What are some things that we rub? Hmm. Oh. My dog, he loves when I rub his tummy. 
Rub, 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 rub. Scratch, 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 scratch. Excellent. Okay, let's see. I think we have a few more words. <gasps> drop. Oh, this is a good one. Drop. What is drop? If I'm holding something and I let go, what happened? The letter D. It dropped. Lift up. Drop. Excellent. Very nice. Thank you so much for reading with me today. I hope you enjoyed reading the story about Lisbon and her dinner. I was worried that she was going to eat a bug or a mouse or dog food, but she just had to wait for her delicious dinner. Mmm, dinner. Oh, now I'm hungry. Well, it looks like our time is over. I'm gonna go get some food. What are you doing after class? Hmm. Sounds good. Well, I hope you have a great time. And if you had fun today, come back tomorrow and we can continue having fun, learning, and speaking English together. Okay, see you later.